All right, I've been wanting to do this video for so long, and I said in my last video that if I get 200 subscribers, I will make this video, even though I got the 200 subscribers before I could even post a video announcing that I'll, I'll make this video if I get 200 subscribers, if that makes even any sense. But if you guys remembered, in my last video, when I went to the Fan Fest, I was targeting... Not targeting. I was trying to get uh, Adolos Garcia to sign specifically my my numbered water burger and his number as well, number fifty three. And then I also say in the video that I actually do this for many other numbers, and um, and I'm trying to get them for all the numbers because all the total numbers. Well, not total. Yeah, there's only ninety six total numbers. Like it only goes through one through ninety six, and I actually do have all of them. And now I'm trying to get them all signed by well, whatever player has worn that number. Or it could even be like, like I even go into detail by like if there's a celebrity that was like in a football movie or just wore like a jersey and everything. Whatever his number is in that, I do that as well. I haven't got any, I haven't gotten anyone to sign that. Like I've, I've had a... I've only had like one celebrity sign a number and I'll show you it, but by the way, I want to show them real quick. These num these numbers, these are not signed. Like there's still so many numbers here, you know, that haven't got signed. These are the unsigned ones, but these are the signed ones. Each and every single number here is signed. And for people that collect autographs, you probably are not gonna love to see them stacked by one another i try i do try to be very careful i'm not gonna like grab it all but i will be going like one by one showing you guys uh which ones have been signed how did i get them signed and yeah these are the numbers that are not signed yet and by the way luca please please luca i want you to sign 77 <laughs> and these are all the signed ones which I'm, I'm about to go over right now. Just showing you guys just a little bit, just so y'all can see what I'm about to present to y'all. I do wanna, I do wanna say a little story first. Um, Cause you're not, you're not supposed to steal the Whataburger numbers, but I do wanna make, I do wanna clear out that all these numbers that I have, not a single one was stolen. Um, but all of these, I literally got them by asking permission by the Whataburger employees or manager there. Um, because, yeah, you're not supposed to steal them. You could that or stuff like that. So um, in case there's any issues with that, no, I only I asked for all of these. There were definitely a ton of Whataburgers that said no, but um, I had some Whataburgers that were like, OK, take one. Or I even I even had I even had a couple just a couple because it was pretty rare. I had a couple water burgers that told me like that that basically gave me the whole stack and I'm like you're insane. Thank you so much. <laughs> but we're about to start now. We're gonna start from the from the from the top to bottom from basically from one through ninety six. Starting off, we got number two that was signed by Johnny Menzel. It was at the Dallas it was at the Dallas Card Show and. It was a pretty cool event, you know. Something that I something that I love when I get these signings, like there's always funny reactions by the players. They're always they they either like just have a laugh about it, or they would tell me that they've never signed this or anything. And like, like with 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 Johnny Menzel, he kind of just went like, like 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 that's funny or whatever. Number three, signed by uh, Brandon Cooks. It was at a paid event it was called like the it's me brands also i also have a lot from from them it's really cool they always get they always have like cool players uh that attend and sign for us so i really really appreciate that from them you're gonna see a lot from from their brand and a lot from the dallas card show number four is miro heshkinen i think I, I hope i said the name right it's from the dallas stars it was when i got this one while i was um when they had a uh, open practice and when the practice ended, players were coming out. I had I brought a ton of them with me, so just pulling them out, like just being like, "Hey, would you sign this?" and they'd sign it. As you can see, I try to do a little green on this one since they have since they are like the Dallas Stars, and but 
immediately regretted it because you could barely see it. And then I switched to black on some of these. But then I had a black Sharpie that day, which you will see later on. Number five, Ian Kinsler. It was he was he was an alumni that was signing at before a Rangers game. So yeah. Number six, Josh Young. Also before a Rangers game. He they like sat him in the table and he was signing autographs. Super cool. Number seven, Pudge Rodriguez. A free event that was like in down in my city and downtown. It was a pretty long wait, but I love that he wrote Hall of Fame, Hall of Famer. Super cool. Number 10, Vince Young was also at the Dallas Card Show. Number 12, Derek Harper, uh, also at the Dallas Card Show. Like I said, you're going to see a lot from the Card Show or the It's Me brand. Um, number 13, Joey Gallo. Really love that I got this one signed by Joey Gallo because Joey Gallo, like, I started watching, like, baseball back in, like, 2013 or 14. And Joey Gallo, like, I think he started playing, like, in 2015 or something. And, dude, he immediately became, like, my my favorite player in the Rangers. And to this day, he is actually still one of my favorite players. When the Rangers played the Twins, I brought, like, a big old sign welcoming him back because it was his first game back in Texas. So that was really cool right there. Love it. Number 15, World Series champion Bruce Bochy. Yes. <laughs> Who else to sign number 15? Then the manager to to bring a trophy for the Rangers, the first one. Number sixteen, uh, Joe Pavelski. It was written and 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 it's all. It was also at the Dallas Stars open practice, but it um it was signed in gold because it was all he had in his hand and he signed it. So yeah, number seventeen, Nathan Avaldi, super cool. Number eighteen, Mitch Garver. It's so cool. These are super cool now that, now that the fact that they're World Series champions. This was also like before a Rangers game. The Valdi one, it was a paid event at a in a mall. I forgot what I forgot the name. Pros and Heroes. I think that was the name. I forgot. I think it was Pros and Heroes. Number no, Sorry, I lost my voice. Number 19, Juan Gonzalez, a Rangers Hall of Famer. Really cool. He wore number 19. Number 20, Ezekiel Duran, another signing before the Rangers game. Number 22, John Gray. It was a winter caravan. I wonder if many, I wonder if many of y'all are familiar with that. Number 23, George Teague out of the Dallas Cowboys. He did wear 31 with the Cowboys, but... Uh, I didn't have 31 when he signed this, and he did wear 23 when he played for the for the Dolphins, and like like he wrote 31, and then he also wrote like Cowboys, so I think that's really cool. Number 24, Rope Hints. Hopefully, I said that name right again. Again, Dallas Stars open practice again with the green. I mean, this one's actually a really cool autograph, but Kim, uh, I I really feel like I messed up with the green sharpies. Number 26, Deron Bland from the It's Me Brands. Dallas, you know, it's, it was called Dallas Sports Spectacular, so I'll start saying that. From Dallas Sports Spectacular, that was cool. And it's also really cool because some, like, they've also have used, like, the picture I took of him signing for, like, some of, like, the, like, to promote Bland, like, public signing. Really love that. That was cool. Number 27, Tony Beasley. Third base coach uh, for the Rangers. Long time coach for the Rangers too. Number twenty nine, Jake Ottinger. This is when I start. This was open practice, and this when you could start seeing. I started using the black sharpie, and I that's when I and I found out that the sharpie was like kind of dry, and I'm like, oh no, this autograph still looks super cool though. Okay, number thirty, uh, Nathan Nathaniel Lowe. First base for the Rangers. You know, he's a World Series champion. Gold glove, silver slugger. You name it. What a career for him. Number 31, Al Harris. Wore 31 his whole career. And now he's the DB coach for the Cowboys. I really like this one. Number 32, John King. It was at a winter caravan. He played for the Rangers. Now he doesn't. Um... 
Yeah. <laughs> that's that's what kind of sucks about some of these autographs. I've got these signed when they were with the Rangers or Cowboys or whatever team. But and then it gets to the point where they're not even in the team no more. And it kind of sucks. Because, like, yeah, whatever. I could get 32. I might get 32 from someone else late, uh, soon. It's not official yet, though. Because I'm definitely going to do this until I get all 96 signed. Number 33, Dane Dunnings, Rangers, Winter Caravan. Number 34, uh, Rangers, Hall of, uh, like Hall of Famer, I believe, Jim Kern. He um, got this at a uh, Defend Fest like last year. I could get Nolan Ryan. Sneak peek. I could get Nolan Ryan in a couple weeks for 34. Number 35. Uh, how do you, how do I say his first name again? Demar Dem Demar Demar Demar. Ah, I feel bad because he's a he's a long form name. I actually loved him with the long horns. Overshone. He wore zero for the long horns. Now he wears thirty five for the Cowboys. Number thirty six. Wyatt Langford. He got drafted by the Rangers. Number four. He wore thirty six in college. I got this when I went to go watch a Frisco Rough Riders game, and he was signing a lot of autographs, and he was really nice about it. Number thirty seven. Mike Baxick played for the Rangers and had a pretty good career in baseball. Kind of known for giving up Barry Bonds home run, 756, but I probably shouldn't say that. <laughs> number 40. Who's this? Who signed number 40? Jeff Russell. Jeff Russell signed number 40. I'm sorry. Sorry to not remember it. Number 40. Another Ranger. I think playing, I think in the Hall of Fame for the Rangers. I forgot. Number 42. Deuce Vaughn, Dallas Sports Spectacular, number 43, Hunter Lipke, he wore 43 during the preseason, he wears 40 now, see what I mean when they change numbers, Ugh. number 44, Andrew Heaney, Rangers, number 45, uh, what's his name again, Derek Collin, I cannot believe I ever forgot his name. He was one of my favorite players at once. Derek Collin, 45, former Ranger. 46, Brock Burke, Texas Rangers again. Uh, Winter Caravan, I believe. Number 47, Josh Smith, Winter Caravan. Number 48, Jacob DeGrom, Winter Caravan. Wiz. The authentication. Super cool. Number 50, JP Martinez. I literally got this sign a week after he got a week before he got traded. Like why? <laughs> number 50 number 51, Mike Maddox, his plane number with the Mets. Number 52, Taylor Hearn. Again, not with the Rangers no more. But oh well, it's still cool. Number 53, the Holy Grail, Adolis Garcia. Mm, I can't can't stop looking at that one. <laughs> Number 54, Martin Perez, former Ranger now. He's with the Pirates now, but I, it was still cool to get this one signed by him. Number 55, Leighton Vanderesh. I got this in, in the convention. He wasn't even like signing. Oh. He wasn't even like signing. He was like just like trying to promote, I guess, for like a friend maybe. And he was there. And I, I brought that and asked him if he could sign that. Number 59, Brett Hayes. Playing number. I think it's number with the Rangers like 87 now. Number 61, Cody Bradford. Get rid of that focus. Number 63. Uh, I can't really I can't remember his first name, but I know he plays for the stars. The Donoff, again, this was at this open practice. Once again, giving Black Sharpie a try. It was a little dry, but I, it's a cool autograph. I like it. Number 64, and this is what I meant that I don't do just players. But this was signed by Charles Martinet, the voice actor of Mario. Wrote my name there too, like Super Diego, Superstar. It was so cool. Like He signed this and did the Mario voice. That was awesome. Why 64? I mean, come on. Nintendo 64. Super Mario 64, Mario Kart 64. Like, how could I not have gotten signed 64? I think it's perfect, and I think it makes sense. Number 65, Grant Anderson, Texas Rangers. Focus. Number 66, uh, Josh Bors, 
through the final out for the Rangers to win the World Series. And I just love, love, love that he wrote final out. So cool. Number 69. This is definitely one of my top three favorites. Dennis Rodman. Why 69? Just search up Dennis Rodman, Dallas Mavericks, and I promise you, you'll find a picture of him holding up his jersey that says 69. Before the the um the NBA said nah. -uh. <laughs> oh wait, I'm I'm going a little off order here. Oh well, it's just a no. It's just one off one. Number 68, Joe Barlow. I'm pretty sure he's still with the Rangers. I'm certain that he's still with the Rangers. Number 70, who else to get 70 but Zach Martin? Mm -hmm. Again, Dallas Sports Spectacular. Number 72, Jonathan Hernandez, Texas Rangers. This was Winter Caravan as well. Number 74, Bob Lilly, you know, the first ever Dallas Cowboy. Dallas Card Show. He was a cool guy. I mean, look, he wrote Hall of Fame 80. That was that was for free. Number 78, Joe Looney. He wore 78 for college and like I think for I think for another team. But he wore 73 for the Cowboys. But um 73, I'm holding that one for another person. And I hope he signs it. Tyler Smith. I want Tyler Smith to sign 73. He signed 78 though. Pretty cool. Number 81, Rocket. Ishmael, I think that I hope I said the name right. I'm probably I probably said some of these names wrong, and I'm sorry about that. Rocket Ishmael, love this autograph. I just love how it's like it's one of my, one of the unique ones. Definitely one of my favorites. This one's also one of my favorites, 100%. Des Bryant, number 88. This was actually the first one I ever got signed, and because I was not even planning on doing any of this until I got this one signed. Um. I've met him in public and like I knew I knew he was going to be there so I brought the number with me and I got like super excited and something that still pisses me off to this day I got super excited that I accidentally grabbed where he signed and you can see my fingerprints there ah it hurts we're almost done though number 91 Tyler Sagan from the Dallas Stars another one from the open practice and as you can see the dry black sharpie ah it hurts Number 92, Dorn Armstrong, Dallas Sports Spectacular, Dallas Cowboys. Number 93, Jim Jeffco, who did wear 77 for the Dallas Cowboys. He actually wore 77 for the Cowboys his whole career. He did wear 93 in college, though. I, I showed him this, and he was like, how did you know? I, I do my research when I want a certain player to sign. <laughs> and then the last but not least, this is also one of my favorites. Uh, DeMarcus Ware, Dallas Cowboys. I mean, everybody knows who DeMarcus Ware is. I think it was the perfect one for 94. And that's all the numbers um, right there. I do have an Instagram, I, I said in my last video. I'll put it again in my bio where I post all of them. And then when I get new ones, again, I post them and everything. So I'm t I am taking a little break right now until I, maybe I find another like paid event and everything. Some I always I always go like through websites like there's there's a website called CraveTheAuto.com something like that that like posts like autograph signings that are gonna be like public like in Texas and other states. So I keep an eye on that on those on that stuff. But yeah, so like that's all the numbers I got. If you made it through the end, thank you for watching and like yeah, if you got. That's all I have to say. I don't know what else to say. Uh, thank you for watching, and um, sorry for being gone so much. I I, I don't even have to say it. I did technically retire doing YouTube videos. I will do. I will still do NFL draft reactions. Those are all, those always give me the views. <laughs> and it's just I retired from doing like the predictions. I still did them, but I'm not. I don't. I'm not. I'm just not gonna record myself and saying what I who I think is gonna win anymore. Like yeah. But tune in. I'll still make videos. Thank you for watching. Have a good day. See you guys.